Welcome to the Nav Viking tutorials. I'm Johannes Gudmundsson, founder of Anecta, a Microsoft Dynamics NAV Gold certified partner. Hello and welcome to the Nav Viking coffee mug tutorials. What I wanted to go over today is um, a system called Dynamics 365. Now obviously you guys have been watching these videos maybe some of you um, and uh, I've always been demoing NAV Dynamics NAV and that is of course the system we love however um, my data or Dynamics 365 is is really NAV in the cloud it's just rebranded as Dynamics 365 uh, for financials now this is a system that does not have all the features and functionalities of standard NAV, so it's a little bit stripped down, at least at the moment, and Microsoft is uh, kind of working on extending that out. But uh, I thought it would be a good idea to kind of jump in here and start demoing this, uh, Dynamics 365, uh, so kind of show you the possibilities that we have in the cloud. So. I just logged in and as you can see I'm in the cloud and if I click here on the uh, tiles that are available to me I see here I have Dynamics 365 for financials and if I click on that I get this project Madeira which is uh, the uh, the code name for Dynamics 365 and I log in to my start page. I'm logged in, in under Business Manager in Cronus US, which is the demo company for uh, Dynamics 365. Now, what I want to do is actually create a new company. So this is going to be my first uh, video of series where I'll go through creating a company and kind of setting up the Coffee Mug International inside uh, Dynamics 365. So in order to do that, um, uh, I'm logged in yeah, as so the business manager. I can't really see anything here except customers, vendors, and items. Um, and I just have the actions up here. So, But we do have the search function, just like in NAV. It's all the way here to the right. And I get a search, and I want to look for companies. Uh, um, and I click here. And now I get a list of companies. Now I want to hit new to create a new company. I'm going to call it Coffee uh, Mac International. And I want the assisted company setup. So what that'll do is actually when I log into this company, it will help me set it up or as we go through it. Uh, now it starts thinking because it's setting up the new company. And we'll just wait for it to go through its phases. Uh, and yes, they are working on it. Now this is pure cloud, um, so there is no on-prem option for Dynamics 365. And uh, like I said before, it does, have, does not have all the features that NAV has. It actually is far from it, uh, but it does have enough to do your sales purchasing inventory, uh, accounting, etc. And it is growing in feature list day by day. Um, so that's sort of why we are jumping into this to see the differences. Okay, now it created that. Now I close this out. So how do I actually change a company? I go here up into the settings and I see Dynamics 365 for financial settings, my settings. Here I can change my role um, my role center. So if I wanted to be something else than a business manager, I could pick that. I also can change the company and the work date. So I'm just going to go and change company, pick my new company, hit OK. And then it tells me I have to sign out and in again. That's fine. So I go into my sign in, I hit sign out. And now I get this pretty picture of a light bulb. And now I sign back in and project my data comes up. And what I should see, if everything went well, is my new company. 
and it should start assisting me in setting it up. So obviously it's creating a whole new company uh, and setting it up. So it takes a little bit of time, you know, a few minutes. All right, so here we get, welcome to the company setup. All right, I just hit next. Company was set uh, uh, ready to use when setup has completed. Yes, um, that's fine. Um, specify your company's address information. So we are on one, two, three, uh, 50th street. Um, three, three. City, New York, state, NY. This 10 United States or US. Okay, so we don't have the countries, that's okay. Let's just create a new one. US. All right, that's okay. And put in a couple of logo later. Phone number is going to be. Email. Oops. Um, like that. Okay. We'll do the banks later. Uh, my accounting. When does a when do I want it to start? On the first. That's fine. And then that's it. Okay, so hopefully we'll get into our company. I think it's sticking again. And it's working on it. So now we have the Coffee Mug International company set up in uh, Dynamics 365 for financials. And uh, so in later videos, we're going to start exploring how to set this up uh, further. Thank you. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. As always, we welcome any questions or suggestions. Um, so leave comments or, of course, if you can subscribe, that would be awesome. Uh, we are trying to build our fan base over here at Anacta. And uh, if you want to look for further information, please go to anacta.com.